This video is brought to you by CatBeast.com. Design your own custom snapbacks and hats. Yeah, I know I have to finish this. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Introspective, and welcome back to Smash Ultimate in Different Languages, a sentence many of you gave up on ever hearing. But hey, better late than never, I suppose. Now, to be fair, a lot has happened in the world of Ultimate since the first video, and I honestly just forgot to go back to this. But you guys have been persistent in asking for part 2, and I'm happy to provide it now that things have settled down once again. So, we're gonna do the second row of languages, and I really just hope there's something worth seeing still. Yeah, I'd say there's stuff worth seeing still. Starting off with good old Dutch, and what I find funny is that most of the character select screen has the English names. There's a few slight modifications here and there, but then all of a sudden you get to motherfucking Villager, and he's... Now, Villager is obviously the highlight of the Dutch character select screen, but I think the second coolest thing has to be me, Cyborg. Alright, that's awesome. I want to play as a fucking cyborg. He says my main's name with such gusto. I love it. Big Battlefield has the word Groot in it? Is the word big in Dutch Groot? Like Guardians of the Galaxy? Can someone confirm this? Because that's pretty cool. Man, spelling tests in the Netherlands must suck. Is it just me or does Dutch DDD have more bass in his downtime? Alright, why isn't Jukebox just the standard for this? This is so much better. As beautiful a tongue as Dutch is, it's time to move on to Mother Russia. Unlike the Dutch character select screen where only a few things are changed, everything's in Russian here, and I'm not even gonna try to pronounce this shit. I'll butcher it. Seems a little different than what was presented there on the screen, but you know, maybe I just haven't brushed up on my pronunciation. I really like Ken's name in Russian. Ke. King Karol. That is not how you pronounce King Club. Good sir. He protect, he attack, but most importantly, he heck. You know what's funny about this is like the entire screen has changed, but then you just got Rob. Yeah, it's just fucking Rob, just chilling. Man, spelling tests in Russia must suck even worse. Oh shit, it's oh heck. Honestly, it's worth putting the game in Russian just to hear the announcer pronounce all of the different character names. Each one is pretty cool. It's a great time, trust me. Just go through it. You won't regret it. These language changes on this side don't seem to be as in-depth as the first side, but I'm hoping that Chinese is going to change that. So, in simplified Chinese, the character select screen is the exact same as the Japanese character select screen. I know that Chinese Jigglypuff has the same name and voice as Japanese Jigglypuff, but I just can't get over how cute it is. Seriously, this has to be the cutest fucking thing in all of video games, is this voice. Alright, let's be real, Ivysaur sounds pretty cute too though. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! That's some god-tier voice acting. Quick tangent here, I didn't cover this in the first video, but Sonic sounds different in pretty much every language, and they're all hilariously bad. Just listen to this. There's pretty much no difference between the two forms of Chinese, so we're just gonna move on to the final language, Korean. Now, I like Fluffy, I like Cinnamon, but let me introduce you to Yol. I'm pretty disappointed because all the Korean names are just the English names, there's nothing that really sticks out. What the fuck is that? Wasn't the bad Ejaculation Saul translation the Korean one? All of the Korean voices are just the Japanese voices, which are also the Chinese voices. So basically, all of the Asian languages in this game kind of just showcase the same stuff, so unfortunately I don't have anything left to show, but I wanted to make this episode because you guys really wanted to see it, and it kind of just warmed my heart that anything I make, you guys want to see more of, and I appreciate it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this second part, 
Also, special thanks to Cat Beast for sponsoring. Check them out in the link in my description. You can design your own custom snapbacks and hats, and it's pretty cool. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, as always. Have a great day. Deuces!